Hello! I'm going to be doing the lemon stitch. It's a really easy stitch that has a nice textured look and it's pretty and it's also dense so you can use it for blankets, scarves. I think it would make a nice purse. Uh, it's a repeat type of pattern but it's super easy to memorize. So you want to start with even number stitches and then you're going to do plus one. Okay, and you're starting out. So I'm going to do 10 chains. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10 plus one. So to start out in the first row, you're going to go into the second chain, not the chain where the loops coming from, but the second chain, which is basically your last chain that you did. That would be chain number 10. And I'm going to do a single crochet. Then I'm going to work a double crochet. And if you don't know how to do double crochets, I recommend you learn how to do them before you do this stitch, but it's really easy. I'll do one or two explaining how you do it. I have tutorial playlist on how to do various stitches, your basic ones. Okay, so I rec recommend to know those stitches before you try this stitch, but it's up to you. Okay, wrap around, go down into the next stitch, wrap around, bring it through the hole. You have three on your, three on your hook. Wrap around, go through two. Wrap around, go through the remaining two. That's a double crochet. Then you're going to go and do the next chain. You're going to do a single crochet. And then again, you're going to do a double. So basically you alternate. Single, double, single, double, all the way to the end. So you start with a single and you end with a double. Wrap around, go down through, wrap around. Wrap around, go through two, wrap around, go through two. The next one, you're going to do a single. You don't wrap around before you go down to the hole. Go through the hole. Wrap around, you have two on the hook. Wrap around, go through those two. Double in the next chain. Go through two, go through two. Then you're going to do a single. And then a double is your last chain. So you end with a double. Start with a single, end with a double. Super easy pattern. Now to start the next row, you're going to simply chain one and turn your work. So you see how it has this sort of a bumpy appearance. I think that's why they call it the lemon stitch. Some people also call it the seed stitch, just so you know. If you get confused, you'd be like, wait a minute, and you see a video on seed stitch and you're like, that looks like the lemon stitch. That's because it is. Um, anyway, so nice textured look there. So because we're starting a new row, we're going to start with, in the very first stitch, a single crochet. And then we're going to go and do a double in the next stitch. And I want you to notice something. It's okay, you don't have to. But... When you're doing this double, you're going into the previous row single. See, see, you're going to see how it's going to alternate, and that kind of helps give its texture. So, because you did a double, now you're going to do a single, and you're doing a single into the previous row's double. And that's why it alternates, and it helps give it that texture. So, it's very important you do even numbers and remember that step. And then a double, the previous row's single. And then a single, the previous rows double, and that's it. You just alternate. Isn't that easy? And I'm going to pause this and ending the row with a double stitch before we proceed with row three. See a nice even edge? Okay, you're going to chain one and turn your work.
single crochet into the very first stitch. So you don't count this one that the loops in, but you go down to this first stitch in that row, you're going to start with a single. And then double, wrap around, go down under, wrap around, wrap around, go through two, wrap around, go through two, and then single, then double, and it's just a really easy stitch that's nice and textured, makes nice pretty baby blankets. Now I do giveaways. If you're not familiar with my channel, I have, if you go click on my name, my username, and go to my about page. So click on about when you get to my, when you click on my username, click on about, and then you go to my main channel page, you'll see my trailer video on my channel scroll down and you're going to see all kinds of playlists i have a craft tutorial playlist i do all kinds of crafts lots of crochet stud and uh, i do giveaways i do random stuff all kinds of different types of videos i'm like the walmart <laughs> of youtube channels because i have so many different types of videos on my channel page i'm not just a one type of video on my channel page i have poodles i have all kinds of outdoor stuff. I live near the lake. I just do a lot of different stuff. Anyways, oh, I have. If you like to listen to the Bible being read, I uh, have a Bible reading playlist. So, yeah, just lots of different stuff. And end always end with a double. How easy is that? And it's a pretty textured look. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you would like to see a specific type of stitch or pattern, I do a lot of baby stuff, baby booties, baby blankets, baby um, hats, lots of different stuff. I also will create, I have some stitches that I have created, patterns that I have created, and I do a lot of different types of crafts. I hope you have a blessed day. I appreciate if you would give a like and help me get some visibility. Uh, comment and um, subscribe, of course, if you're new to my channel. Go to my channel page and see all the stuff I got. Have a blessed day.